<laughs> Alright guys, how's it going? We're back in Fallout 4 and I'm following a pretty ludicrous quest chain and I'm hunting down Travis the DJ again <laughs> Right, looks like he's over this way No, I'm expecting some kind of trap in all honesty Yeah, it's true Shot in the ass last year. Long story. That's better than taking an arrow to the knee. What's going on here? Oh, wow. You're tall. Mama? Not Hi there. To talk to people, My friends say know. outside is smell. But you don't smell at all. Okay. Thanks. All right. Diamond City Radio. Right, Scarlet and Travis. This doesn't look so. Hey there, what's going on? Right, uh, have you seen Vadim? Have you seen Vadim? He was grabbed at the dugout, and Yafin thought you might know where Bull took him. What? That's that's not a funny joke, like at all. Just tell me. I'm not screwing around here, Travis. I need to know right now. You're not. You weren't joking. Oh, oh man, wow, is this, this is because of what happened, isn't it? It's, it's my fault. It doesn't matter. Look, Vadim's had dealings with those guys before. Why they took him doesn't matter. Getting him back does. You're right. We've got to get him back. Look, I don't, I don't really, I mean, I don't have a lot of friends. If Vadim is missing or in trouble... Or whatever, then I'm gonna help get him back. Uh, no, I don't think so. It's probably gonna be dangerous. I expect things will get ugly. I'm not, I, I'm not stupid. I know that. I've heard enough to know they're probably holed up at the old Beantown Brewery. We've gotta go in there, show them we mean business, and, and then we can bring Vadim back, and everything will be okay. Right? I'll... I'll get a gun, and I'll meet you there. We'll settle this. Right, so maybe not a trap after all. However, I don't really want to take Travis. I'm on a break right now. So I can see, Scarlet. Right now. Yeah, because of my uh, Lone Wanderer perk, where I get bonuses for being alone, I don't really want to take Travis with me. <laughs> That's as good an excuse as any. Now, what am I gonna do? Right, the Beantown Brewery, we know where that is. It's quite nearby the... Here it is, yeah? Quite nearby the Cambridge Police Station. I remarked on it. Now, let's just head out there then. All you outsiders wear such funny clothes? I can't really argue with that comment, can I? This uh, C hat is a bit stupid now. Right, what I'm going to do is set up all of my missions and I'm going to head out here on foot. Now, I thought there might have been something on the way, but I guess not. And let's head over in this direction anyway. Right, I need to keep an eye on my health as well. That's not looking too good. Right, off we go. Now it's pretty dark, but I'm quite happy with that. It's an alpha. Right, 
Right, going for its head with my shotgun. Nice. There's still another one though. <laughs> a shotgun to the mouth. Christ, there's more? Right, better be careful here. Dog call. Hmm. Right, I'm going the wrong way. <laughs> no surprise to anybody. Let's just continue along here though, because there's a mission to clear out raiders here. Right. Yeah, I should also be using my favoured weapon instead of the shotgun. I have a go with the sniper rifle here as well. Now something nearby me because my little green brackets are pretty close, yeah. Rad roach. Not sure I should be using my sniper rifle on rad roaches. Now what's going on in here? Did I actually miss? Right. Now, what have we found in here? Eddie Winter Hollow Tape. Message to Rodrigo Palama. Okay, my friend. I thought about it. And I've reached a decision on the Fallon's job. Your cut is exactly what you deserve. Zero dollars. Zilch. You heard me right. You get nothing. Yes, you cracked the safe. And yes, we got the diamonds. But you also tripped the alarm. Mackie got pinched, and that's entirely your fault. Now, when he gets out, Mackie's gonna want your head on a platter. I'm gonna give him your share instead. I see you're getting off easy. Eddie Winter, signing off. Okay. Precinct 8 Evidence Terminal. Right, case 046IR. Julian's inciting a riot logs. Doesn't seem important. Winter holotape logs? Hmm. Right, map's been updated. Right, holotape 8 is missing from the evidence cabinet. That's the one that I found. Right, yeah, this is all it is here. Right, so the South Boston Police Department would be what was updated for me there. So that's another place I can go. <laughs> Once I get through all of this though. So many zones in this game. There's a super mutant down there. Let's go search his body. Yeah, again, I'm heading the wrong way. I need to set a, a marker. 
so that I at least know what direction I'm travelling. I've got too many missions on my map now. So if you head to the hollow box after setting a marker, Right, we've got a feral ghoul. I'm actually going to return. Take out the ghoul with my laser. Legendary. Christ, that's not good. Critical didn't even take him out. Powerful board down. What is this? 25% more damage from this legendary bit of wood. Nice. So there must be legendary creatures in the game that drops legendary weapons. I read something about it, but I wasn't really expecting to find them out in the streets. Yeah, it's very important as well to use your criticals against some of these bigger, bigger mobs because I wasn't doing an awful lot of damage otherwise. But that critical shot to the head, 80% of his health gone. Now, what have we got down here? I thought it was security and I was right. Now we're getting pretty close to this Raiders from the back street. Now what was that? That was pretty nearby, that explosion. Yeah, maybe night time's not the best time to be out and about. <laughs> right, I'm finding it hard to find anything on the map because I've got all my quests packed here. Yeah. <laughs> but I know I'm nearby this one to clear the raiders. Right. Actually, I'm not going to do that. I'm going to return. Brought my sniper rifle for a reason. Right. If you hold down Alt, it steadies your aim. Yeah, you can see it's not very steady right now. But it drains your action points. Didn't take him out. Oh. 
Mate, there's four of them. And there's a turret there as well. Come on. Right, we'll be careful of the turret, but the rest of it doesn't seem that threatening. Why is it not shooting at me facing the wrong way? What's shooting at me? Something in here. Wait, let's get inside. I wasn't really expecting this. Right, time to get buffed up. Hmm, psycho tats. Right, I've got plenty of buff jet as well. That's a bit of a waste of buff jet there. Right, these turrets are not really that threatening so long as they can't see you. <laughs> Yeah, I'm still alive. Playing games with me, huh? No need to hide. No It'll sign of him now. Soon. Right, there's quite a few raiders in here then. Now, my guess is most of them are going to be in here. Nice. Right, there's a named one here. Let's take him out to the head. That's a horror. Down she goes. <laughs> this is bullshit. Hey, <laughs> getting shook up over nothing. What the hell happened there?
Right, a cooler. 55 bobby pins remaining. Sweet. I'll take that beer. Go back to the shotgun while I'm up this close. Right, eternal, but it's advanced. Code. There's actually quite a lot of ammunition in here, but maybe not an awful lot more. Annoying when you can't get into terminals and stuff though. Now, there's still people around here. I'm going to clear it out properly. What the? Yeah. You notice that even the raiders now are taking a lot more damage, aren't they? Don't stick your head out, God, those son. I'm not done yet, though. You gotta reload sometime, asshole. Oh, man, come back. I was having fun. Now let's see if I can take it out of the sniper rifle. Really nice lighting effects here. Torso should do it. That would appear to be that. Right, now there's more ways up yet. I'm taking this leather now because of some of the leather chest pieces I saw in the town, yeah? So maybe I want to think about making my own armour rather than this spike stuff. Now what's this? Another Grognak the Barbarian. So that's three of these I've found now. Right, we've got a safe over here. It's a master though. I don't think I'll bother with this toothbrush. <laughs> it's all the same. <laughs> Right, now another way out by the looks of things. Christ. Now we were talking about this in the comments in one of my other videos. The reason that broke so fast was because, if you remember my last attempt, 
I'd weakened the, the lock pick quite considerably before I was able to pick it. <laughs> and that's why it broke so early there. That's it. Right, so back out to the fens. Pretty nice, yeah. Right. Now, you haven't really seen me using mines a lot. But it's something I'm going to think about. If I ever come up against something really big and scary, that's when you use mines, generally. So, where to next? I guess we just keep on moving along, yeah? Now that we're along the waterfront, we can... Probably just follow this along. Right. Yeah, let's just stick to the plan of along the waterfront. I'm not really keen in that pistol now any longer, to be honest. It just doesn't really seem to cut it. But to be honest, everything's rather poor <laughs> compared to... This laser rifle I've got now. My righteous authority. Bone saw. Oh Christ. Well, hopefully that was really, really heavy. This is probably more useful than uh, the combat knife I'm carrying, yeah? 11 damage, although it's got fast speed. This is double the damage and an extra 25. Hmm. I should probably just ditch this blue paint, even though it's got oil in it, and oil is quite hard to come by. <laughs> I'm not carrying around 15 kilos in that. This Carlyle typewriter's pretty good though, yeah, look at all the mats in that. Even though it's 5 kilos. Right, that's freed up a bit more weight. Carrying around 5 kilo tins of paint. <laughs> yeah. It's such a cool game. Really enjoying this playthrough. I would say I'm enjoying this more than I enjoyed Fallout 3. Let's get the sniper rifle out. That's my powerful board. That's why the sniper rifle's so good. Now, what were these raiders doing though, just hanging around here? There's something nearby. I'm pretty laggy again. Really laggy here. God, performance is terrible.
Yeah, so being detected by something. Scavenger. Why is he hostile? That's interesting. No. I guess they just don't want me going near there. I'm going to avoid that for now. It's not part of my main mission. Oh, it's so smart here, but God, my performance is low mid-20s, yeah? Frames. Right, so we're heading up here. So we're actually heading across here now. Let's check out what this is first of all though. Yeah, I think it's the lighting effects that's causing so much of the dips in performance. I'll take these carrots. This is probably upsetting somebody, but... Too bad. Now... Oh, somebody's dead, I think. Day Trapper. That's another kind of drug. Now, could there be some Nuka Cola? No. We've got to find Nuka Cola for a mission as well. <laughs> Normally you're tripping over it, but I haven't seen any for God knows how long. Right, so let's see what this novice locked door is all about. Got it. Right. Glowing fungus? I'm not quite sure why I would be stealing this fertilizer but not stealing anything else. Right, well let's craft some stuff seeing as I'm at my favourite station, yeah? <laughs> I've got plenty buff jet. Now, I should make some of this great mentats. The good thing about this is I'm going to be losing the weight of the whiskey as well. Let's make three of that. Can probably cook one or two of these orange mentats as well. It's not that handy for me because I've already got such a high perception anyway. Now what's this? Ultra jet overdrive? Right, so that's what fertilizer's used for. Mines. Makes sense of course. Right, that'll do me for now. Now what's this? A short syringer rifle? Craft ammo for the syringer at a chemistry station. Interesting. Well, let's give this a go, yeah? <laughs> syringer ammo. Bleed out syringe. Right, so it does 30 points of damage over 10 seconds. Well, let's give this a go then. It uses oil, so I'm not going to make too much of it. Now, I wonder how much ammo you get for that. My short syringer rifle. Minus 30 hit points. Right. Well, I'm going to try this out anyway. Right, it doesn't appear to have any ammo in it though. Right, that's bleed out syringe. Not really sure. I don't want to use it because it'll give me minus 30 hit points if I do, yeah? I've got a level here to do. I'm now level 11. Damn. Right, I guess I'm going to take even more points in sneak, which makes me 30% harder to detect, and I no longer trigger floor-based traps. Yeah, I'm not quite sure about this. Right, if you press the fire button, it brings this up. Right, so clicking on it adds it over. 
Right, so that puts two ammo into it. Given the mats that you put into it, it would need to be really, really good. Now, what have we got here? Nothing. Right, anyway. We're going to continue on to our destination. Yeah, it's pretty cool. I'm going to have to get a better graphics card eventually because I would really like to see this. <laughs> yeah, pretty cool here in this little wood. Right, I've kind of got myself high up in this place that I didn't really want to be. Now, what's been going on here? <laughs> Trees falling on this guy while he was sleeping. <laughs> I shouldn't really laugh, obviously, but... Yeah, not a nice way to go. It's more like Skyrim now. <laughs> now. This looks like my target. The Beantown Brewery. I'm coming in from the back though. Now, something pretty nearby. But it might just be Travis. And it is. Right, so I've discovered the Beantown Brewery. I found Travis. And we'll see what he's got to say in the next episode. Catch you later, guys. <laughs>